So I haven't played this game in a while, and because of that I wanted to do something that would help contribute to the village. You know, because I'm such a nice guy and all. But what was that thing? What could I do or make that would help out the village? I was thinking for a while, and then it hit me. I knew exactly what I was going to do. But first I want to ask you guys a question. What do you think is the number one reason for death in one hour one life? Starvation? Being eaten by bears or wolves? Maybe it's freezing to death. Or is it the damn Skeeters injecting us with the Zika virus or the West Nile virus? Or is it just retardation? What if I told you it was none of those? Would you believe me? I'll tell you what it is. The number one cause of death in this world is loneliness. That's right. You heard me. Motherfucking loneliness. And that's because the goddamn god of this world impregnates our women. So they don't need men. That is until the god doesn't pay for child support and they come running. So what are the men supposed to do to relieve themselves? Why don't they just jerk the chicken you say? Don't you know that masturbation is a sin? We ain't trying to go to hell. In the Bible, from Leviticus 15 verse 2 through 15, it reads, When any man has any unusual bodily discharge, such a discharge is unclean. Whether it continues flowing from his body or is blocked, it will make him unclean. This is how his discharge will bring about uncleanliness. And we ain't trying to be unclean up in here, you know what I'm saying? Because it's way too much work to clean yourself off. Because in the Bible, it also reads, When a man loves a woman, okay, no. When a man is cleansed from his discharge, he is to count off seven days for a ceremonial cleansing. He must wash his clothes and bathe himself with fresh water, and he will be clean. On the eighth day, he must take two doves or two young pigeons and come before the Lord. <laughs> come to the entrance to the tent of meeting and give them to the priest. The priest is to sacrifice them, the one for a sin offering and the other for a burnt offering. In this way, he will make atonement before the Lord for the man because of his discharge. Not only do you need a shower for like seven days straight, you need to sacrifice two doves and two pigeons. Where the fuck are we supposed to get doves and pigeons? Seems like way too much work for just busting a nut. So I came up with a solution, and it starts with the world's oldest profession. Yup, that's right, motherfucking prostitution. But I'm not gonna be the prostitute myself. You know, I'm not. I'm not gonna be doing none of that stuff. Um, that would be a sin, and our God Jason would have sent me straight to hell. But I came up with another solution to that. What are you making? Bravo. So as you saw, I'm going to build a brothel. That way all the lonely men in the village can relieve themselves of all the pent up frustration. Unfortunately for me, I had a lot of kids that got in the way of that plan. I see no shirts, my daughter. So you may be going naked. Let me show you something. This is where our family business will be. It will be a brothel. We will have sexy sheep and pigs here. For the men you know. The lonely ones. Okay. Well, good luck out there my daughter. Don't die on me so young. A boy. Well, you will be naked my son. Take care of my kid. I am sorry. She AFK. And I got work to do. The brothel will not take care of itself. Another kid. Well, that kid is dead as hell. I got bit. Help. <laughs> my son. No. My son is dead. Oh well, I got more left. So as you saw, my work was constantly getting interrupted by the children I was having. And just when I thought I was finally free and I made some progress, I gave birth again. But this time, it was fucking triplets. Holy hell. Triplets. Follow. You guys wanna see the family business? Yeah. Follow me. This is a family business. Kitch? It's a brothel. I will add sexy sheep and sexy pig in each one. Well, that was the plan. I was planning on using sheeps and pigs as the stress relievers in the brothel. I managed to get one of the sexy sheep into one of the rooms, and when I went to go get food to feed the rest of the sheeps and pigs there, you know, so I don't leave the village with nothing, I came across a gruesome scene and saw that the rest of the sheeps and pigs were murdered. They killed my pig, so I killed theirs. They were mine stupid. Luckily I managed to get sheep before it was also a victim of a brutal crime. I was going to use the sheep to help the village get more sheep, but we were all out of berries and since I didn't want to wait a long time for them to grow, I got on a horse with a cart and went to go look for some. 
Unfortunately, I got lost. I tend to do this a lot. I found out last time when I got lost that I can just slash leader to try to find my way back. But of course, with my luck, we didn't have a fucking leader. I'm gonna die lost again. So I died. I didn't want it to end like this, so I decided to be reborn to finish what I started. <laughs> After being reborn and I was old enough, I tracked down my daughter and asked her to give me permissions to the property since she was the one that owned it now. Special. Yes? I need your help. Okay. Follow. Can I get permissions? I was your ma, and I died. I understand. I think he's making a zoo. Yeah. A zoo. Love owns this. After she did, I got back to work. Hello sir, kid. Any of you guys lonely at night? No. Don't lie. Look. You can make love to any of these sheep. No. What the fuck? It's a brothel I made. Don't be shy. The first one is on the house. Oh shit. The girl is gone. You can fuck a sheep now. No. Common. You know you want to. We got wing Wednesday at the brothel. Calm down. Only 50 cent a wing. Good prices and hotter sheep. At the brothel. You wanna come to the brothel. We got hot sexy singles, ready to mingle. Only a few feet away. Hey Afro man. You lonely. Need a good time? Then go down to the village brothel. Maybe. We got sexy sheep down there. He's a builder, not a lover. Damn. I see. He's all work. Builders always die alone. That's why he should go down to the brothel. Who needs a woman's touch? When you can have a sheep instead. Down at the brothel. Now get half off with any coupon. You guys doing good? Need any water? Food? Okay, I will take your silence as a no then. Common, clean yourselves off. We might get some customers soon. Hopefully, if not, I will go into debt. Hey kid, come on down to the brothel when you're older. My children are children of Jason. They will do no such thing. You know, he ain't paying child support. I know, he's a hoe. Hey kid. You lonely. Sad at night? Starting early? Yeah. Business is not booming. Hey, let me finish my pitch. Hey kid. Are you sad, fat and lonely? No one loves you? Are you afraid of dying alone? Well? Worry no more. Down at the village brothel. Pick any one of our sexy sheep. Hey, bring him back. No one wants to fuck my sheep.